Hello folks, Foxlow back again. This is now part 20 of my X4 series. And I said I wasn't going to show me building again, but I lied. I am now. <laughs> Sorry folks, I'm enjoying it too much, so I'm going to just carry on building it. Um, as you can see, look at this. It's the, the, I think the architecture of all the modules are really cool. This is a water module. I paid for these. Um, I got water, wheat, meat I already had and a couple of others I had to pay for so I started I'm doing all the food stuff side first on this side and so really it's not taking too long um, all the NPCs they more or less started to come straight away I've got the hard off hold on they come to they started straight away as soon as I put down the the stuff to be built they more or less started coming in immediately um, resources needed to complete change. There's just a whole parts left to come, and he's already on his way. Look here. Yeah. He's. Um, I'm, I think that's three zones away. I'm not 100% sure about that, so I think that's three zones away. As he's carrying a thousand six hundred and one, it must be a big one, so he'll be a bit slow. But obviously, this is only. This has got the water production has got another 20 minutes to go. Now, if you look at my plan, what I've done so far, see symmetrical. I really like this this look. Um, so yeah, you've got water there, water there, so you've got water, two water productions, and then following on from that, so it's the second lot, is wheat production there, wheat production there. Um, the meat production, I think, will come, ne no, spices will come next. I'll put spices, because uh, to make meat, uh, to make food rations, you need uh, meat, wheat, and spices, and water. Now, the water gets done by, um, obviously, the PHQ, hopefully, because I've given the PHQ, I haven't subordinated them yet until I've got these finished. But two miners, they're going to mine, uh, hopefully, ice, and there's plenty of ice in this friggin' sector, they're in there. So ice will then supply for the water, and then the water will supply for the wheat production, um, uh, the wheat and the spice and the meat then produce the food rations. Now this is all in, in the encyclopedia. If you look at the encyclopedia, where are we? Let's look at the encyclopedia quickly. I didn't really have much of a clue and then working out from the encyclopedia you can see what everything needs. Um, where are we? Station modules. Station modules. Storage, not storage. Um, where are we? Production modules. Okay. Meat production. Electronics, energy, hull parts, and it needs water, okay? So it needs water to produce meat. So if you just wanted to produce meat, you'd think you'd only need water. But, um, spice reduction, where are we? Spice reduction needs water. Food rationing is what they eat. They don't eat the meat. Food rationing needs meat, spices, and wheat to produce. So you need those three to produce that one. Simple as that. It's like it was in the X, X3 as well. You needed lots of other different things to produce one food ration. It's the same as it was in the X3. So you need those three options, those three modules, to reduce the food rations. Um, so that's it's, it's all there if you look at it. So if you just wanted to produce water, you just have the water one and you'd mine ice. Um, but everything needs water. I mean, the food needs water, or the meat. The meat to produce the food needs water. Sorry, the wheat to produce the uh, um, rations needs water. So yeah, I like these. I think the designs are really cool. They're really lovely. I'm I'm dying to see them actually in on the on the actual uh, site itself, rather than this little one, so we can fly over it. I'm liking this one already, it's so cool, and I like to have it without the hard on. So yeah, I mean the encyclopedia is a good indication of what you need to do when you're building stuff. Have a look at what it all needs, so it's great. I'm sure there's somebody um, by now that's worked out a friggin' um, what you call it? A graph showing what everything does, I'm sure there is online somewhere. I might have a look at that later, but I haven't yet. 
it's just by looking at the encyclopedia so we'll go from there um i'm done with exactly this oh look they're starting over there look looks like they're starting the ones that i they do it in the order that you place them down so i place those three down first then i place the same over there and then the last things that were put down was the um spices was it let's have a look let's have a look oh, i'll go back into the module um look fan build oh yeah um yeah i put them all the wheat productions down last so that one was the first one down uh, or the second to last and that was the last one so they'll that was first or well, that was first the um this bit the center bit first second third then i went over the other side and did the same so that was um four five or well, four five six seven oh that was before that one so you know so that's been built now that's probably already built and this will be built second to last and then that will be the last one to be built and have we got any stock here yet no worries he's two away so he's not too far so cool i'm loving it guys i'm really i just sit here and watch him i just sit here and watch so i thought I'd, i thought i'd share it and show where i'm going um and you'll see the last the finished result in a, a few seconds for you but it's going to be a little while for me so i'll get back to you in a mo guys there you guys back again <laughs> my pace has suddenly started to get very busy <clears throat> getting loads of npc uh, ships coming and they're coming to get the water Demeter, sent Look, water traders water refinery because now obviously i've got the um the water's up and running and so they, they're coming in um, droves there. I've just had three or four land all at once. But yeah, the um, modules are now finished. I've got uh, a solid storage um, building now. There's one there. And the second one being built now over there. That's for the ice. I didn't realise it, but you need solid storage for the ice. So <coughs> the two miners are now mining the ice. They went to the other side of the friggin system to get the ice and yet there's look all this ice around here number one has gone right to the other side of the system to find ice weird behavior oh i've got to get rid of this this keeps respawning keeps respawning as ice and then ore then ice and then ore <laughs> i don't like it right in front of the base i keep bloody um destroying it anyway these models are really cool look this wheat one like a little forest they're so uh, nicely designed I think they're really cool look at it working <laughs> that's so cool there's a greenery and there's water up here look. obviously to feed all the plants and you can hear the water as you dry as you fly over what I'll keep your mouth shut. Here, here. This is so cool. So, PHQ is coming along. My Megaplex is going to be ginormous. I told you, first do all the food stuff. Um, it's going to hopefully go right to the other side of that. rock so it joins up with the back end there as well as going down a bit because they obviously got to put all the text stuff in yet well that's the way 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 down the road yet but um doing the food stuff first and the water and i reckon it's going to make money because already it's um attracting the locals so yeah it's coming on and so what it looks like right now i think it's quite cool trying to keep this docking area clear of any um obstacles i will put the um i think i will put the habitats here in the center you got one i have one big one going up this side the same as the other side 
and I probably will, um, I'm going to try and get a freebie of the small size one, so you've got two large on top, and then two small at the bottom, only because of the, uh, the, the design, I want it to look cool, you know, not that I want four habitats to get loads of people, but, um, who's that, who's that coming there, who's over there? Oh, of course, yeah, he delivered stuff there, didn't he? I forgot about him. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, it's coming on. I like it. It's cool. Let's have a look. Let's go back here. Everything looks really cool when it's nice and symmetrical from a distance. Can we go back and get it all in view? Go backwards. Let's take the hut off, so we don't all see the green. There we go, it's uh, coming along nicely. Oh, well, I need to get rid of this stupid thing. These guns will do it. But they take a little while, <laughs> but it does get rid of it. <coughs> yeah, it's coming along. Can we get an outside view and see if that's there? Not really. <laughs> Here you go guys, there it is, look, ah, oh, it's so cool. <laughs> see, try to keep the area by the docking bays all nice and clear. Um, the NPCs are landing quite, quite coolly and easily, it's just our own ships that seem to have a problem. So yeah, I'm liking this building shit. I spent my whole game play session today doing this here um i'll get back to you when i've added some more okay so catch you in a mo back again see my station is getting very busy it's a mineral guy um coming so maybe my manager's asked for some ice because my miners haven't come back yet unless that's one coming in now vulture sent no, now that's me vulture yeah it's getting very busy which is cool. Is he coming as well? Well look, I'm glad I've done this. Um, Green, mineral. Yeah, I bet he's coming. I bet he's coming as well. I'm glad I put these um, e-docks on. So all the biggies and the little little ones can come. So cool. Looking good. There's another one over there, look. Yeah, he's on the middle one, look. Oh, that's cool. Or is my manager buying shit? <laughs> and we're not selling anything, I don't know, you haven't looked at the... Green on the, did, did he land? Is he taking off? Yes. Yeah, that's my station. Any more little ones? Yeah, look, here we go. It's getting busy. Oh, crunch. Oh, so isn't it? Loving it. Got every eye everywhere, the station this size. <laughs> What's this one doing? Have a look, where's he? Magnetar, mineral, bank. Well, yeah, I hope they're buying and not bringing selling. <laughs> I'll check later. We'll see what's happening. But it's cool. Getting busy here. Love it. Okay guys, you know, <laughs> I'll get back to you in a moment. Okay, I'm back again. I um, allocated a freighter to the um, HQ and he's landed and picked up 50 energy cells. The, the manager sent him off to sell that. <laughs> when they can carry 8,200 and he's just selling 50. <laughs> uh, in XT that would be full, a full load he's, set, he's um, sending off to sell, not just 50. So, you know, the profit's going to be a bit nap, I think, for to start with. But um, it will come, I think, eventually. But it's so cool, the station is so busy, but it is. It's um, the manager's 
selling, uh, not selling stuff. He's buying minerals and shit. So they're even using the other bay, the other side. That's where um, my freighter went to pick up the 50 energy cells. He went over here. See, they're all landing here as well, which is cool. So all those extra spaces, put as many docks as you can afford on your PHQ, I reckon. This is so cool. Love it. And I sent one, um, I, I bought a Nemesis because I've lost two ships now in the um, venture on, on an eight hour ones, the two small fighters, I've lost them both. So I sent this time, I've sent a Nemesis, as you can see. He's on an eight, eight hour shift there, I'm hoping I don't lose him. He was, uh, cost me three odd million that dude. So I'm wondering if he, um, he will blow up as well. Or is it a player killing them all? It's quite possible. Players could be killing them. But they could also be killing them, getting killed by Xenon or whatever. That is also the other possibility, but let's hope this one survives. I've decked him out with beams on the turrets and my same guns that I have on my nemesis on the front guns. So let's hope he comes back after the eight hours. He's on an eight hour shift, so um, I'm not sure how long he's got. But let's see. You get a warning, the same noise as he's coming back if he gets killed, if you're actually online or in the game as it happens, because the last one it got deaded. I don't know how, it doesn't tell you how, it just got killed in Grand Ex here in the same um, system as what I'm in, Grand Exchange. Getting really busy. I've spent my whole time, like I said earlier, PlayStation here. Constantly landing, but it is, it's the uh, managers buying shit. If I look at, um, where are we, information, go to station overview, ice, water, wheat, energy cells. Hmm, let's take the energy cells off. It's all going up, but he's, he's buying it. Station account. Hmm. It is going down, I think it was one eleven million nine hundred and something, so yeah, he's, <coughs> he's buying stuff to get this started and get the wheat running. I don't think the wheat's gonna give us much profit, but we'll see. I wouldn't have thought so. Food generally doesn't do much profit. But it's um good to start it all off for the habitats. I need the uh, food rations before I build the habitats. Otherwise, if he, he can't hire staff then. Um, see all this lot bringing in all the ice? My mine is bringing in 562. And all this lot is what the busy is. They're all selling it here at 34 credits. I don't know which is a good option now to um, do the pricing yourself or let him do it. But at the moment I'm letting him do it and see how it goes possibly better to set the price yourself <coughs> depending on how much the station needs because I'm not sure how it all works at the moment uh, energy cells they're selling okay because they they've been given a profit I mean I left 10 million in the account the building well not the building account in the station account and I've taken some money out it got to 13 million something so I took 2 million in my own because I can put it in my own account so it is making a profit slowly, but um, yeah. So I've got to now put the um, meat factory on meat production, so we can get the meat going as well. What did I put the spice on? No, I haven't put spice. I put the spice on first, I think. Yeah, you've got spice and meat. Maybe I put them together. Um, but I'll do that tomorrow. I'll leave it running overnight to make some more money. Because I spent a bit. How much money have we got left? Still low, so I mean 51 million. I had 80, 85 million I had in total. Um, where I bought the... What do you call it? The builder. And then bought all those uh, modules. So that brought it down to 51 million. We'll see how it goes in the morning. 
so guys I'm going to call it here for this one I hope you enjoyed my little um, mess around here seeing how the HQ is being built on my side I've never seen it not that I've watched many videos but I've not seen anybody actually showcase building their HQ and so I thought I'd do it anyway and I'm enjoying it I really am just my type of fun this building and seeing the seeing the results and watching all this traffic coming in and out it's so cool we done it I've got one of these <laughs> he's my ore miner you know argon prime I don't like them so much um, let's just see if I can find one of my ice miners where are we where is he Ice, there we go. Box ice. They go. See how far the way they go. There's ice all round here. Yeah, he's going all the way over here. Stupid pilot. <laughs> look at him. Look. Dicked out to the nines, and he can't mine right next door to the HQ. Stupid pilot. I want to fire him. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, it's cool. <clears throat> there we go, guys, your last look. Zoom right out. There we go. It looks so cool in this light. Anyway, as I said, I thank you very much if you got this far, and I'll catch you in my next one.